welcome back. Today we're going to learn the song Kookaburra. Kookaburra is actually an old Australian nursery rhyme and a kookaburra is a bird. And so if you look at a kookaburra online, you can see what kind of bird it looks like. It's kind of cute. This song we're going to learn is a round. A round is when you sing the same song but come in at different times. So we're gonna learn the song together with the movement and with the music. And then I'm going to have you listen to what it sounds like as a round. And we're also going to talk about how you can add rhythm instruments to the song to play the steady beat or the um, rhythm. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna learn the words first. It goes like this. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree you repeat it after me when I do this. Merry, merry king of the bush is he. Laugh, kookaburra, laugh, kookaburra. Gay your life must be. Okay, so as the song says, he sits in a tree. He's probably a happy bird. He's singing his songs. And they're saying, you must be really happy. That's what merry, merry means, happy, happy. All right, so the song goes like this. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. It's your turn. Merry, merry king of the bush is he. Laugh, kookaburra, laugh, kookaburra. Gay your life must be. Good, it's pretty simple. It's a pretty short song, but the whole point is making it into a round. We're gonna add some pretty fun movements to this. Before we do, we forgot to warm up our voices. So follow my finger and you're gonna do what it does. Woo! Can you do that with me? Woo! Your turn. Good, one more time. Good, okay, are we pretty warmed up now? Let's review how we breathe when we sing. Okay, so we all got a belly. Think about a balloon. When you blow into a balloon, it fills up with air like this. That's the same thing your stomach does. It's supposed to expand out when you sing. When you talk or when you're just living your normal life breathing, you don't really focus on how you're breathing because you don't need to. Your heartbeat you know, beats and it does every, all the work for you. When you sing, you have to breathe the right way or you will run out of air and you'll be kind of, you know, you have to make sure you're filling your lungs up and your belly up with enough air so you can have enough air to sing with. Think about a water hose. I think I've used this expression before, but think about a water hose. When it's bent, like this looks like you know like a v or upside down v the water gets stuck because it is not laying the way it's supposed to when it's laid the way it's supposed to the water goes through think of the water as being air so put your hands on your belly okay and we're going to practice breathing i want you to breathe the wrong way breathe up with your shoulders going up what did the air do it stopped so now we're going to breathe the right way you breathe out and then in like this. Your turn. All right, we are ready to continue with our song. Let's do it together this time. Instead of echoing me, do it at the same time as me, and then we're gonna add stuff to it. One, two, ready, go. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes, he love. Kookaburra love, kookaburra gay, your life must be. When you get to that really high note, you gotta use a bunch of air, so you might take a breath right before it. Now, let's add some motions. Okay, so kookaburra is sitting on an old gum tree. Let's make a tree with our arms, okay? Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry, remember means happy. Merry, merry king of the bush is he. Laugh, you're gonna laugh like this. Ha, 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 ha. You're gonna kinda just jiggle your head around and then gay your life must be, he's going to fly away. Cause he's happy, he's ready to fly. All right, let's talk through it together with the motions before we add it with the song, ready? Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bush is he. Laugh, kookaburra, laugh, kookaburra gay, your life must be. 
Let's sing it together. One, two, ready, go. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes he. Laugh, kookaburra, laugh. Kookaburra, gay your life must be. Now, let's clap the steady beat. And here's what we're gonna do. We're using body percussion. Remember, body percussion is anytime we use our bodies to make music. But you can use rhythm sticks or shaker to keep a steady beat or any other rhythm instruments that you have available. If you're in a classroom, when you do the singing, what you could do, teachers, is have one group of kids doing the rhythm instruments and then the other group groups of kids divided into three parts doing the movements with the round and then they can rotate. If you're at home watching this and you're a homeschool student and you have maybe, even if there's just two of you, one could do the rhythm instruments or body percussion part and the other person sings the song. If there's more than two of you, then you can have some kids do the round in two or three parts and we'll get into that in a minute. So let's go ahead and clap the steady beat together. One, two, ready, go. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes, he laugh. Kookaburra laugh, kookaburra gay, your life must be. Now we're gonna clap the rhythm. The rhythm is the way the words sound. One, two, ready, go. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes, he laugh. Kookaburra laugh, kookaburra gay, your life must be. All right, so then you can transfer that part to instruments and have that group playing that while we do the song. Now, what I want you to do is you're going to pause the video and listen to how the round sounds together. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes. Kookaburra sits on an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes. Kookaburra gay, your life must be. Kookaburra love. Kookaburra gay, your life must be. All right, so as you heard, that was a round in three parts. A round is usually in two parts, three parts, or four parts. So if there are not enough kids, then only do two part round. That's totally fine. Or what I've even done before is have the class be part one and your part two. And sometimes that gets tricky because you'll notice half of the class switches over and they try to be on your part and that's okay. All right, so we learned today about singing in a round we learned about a song from Australia and what a kookaburra is. You guys learned the right way to breathe and remembering to keep a steady beat as you sing the song. I had a great time and I cannot wait to see you next time. Bye.